I was like, I can't keep going. Yo, what up, what up? Victory Vlog Squad. Listen, man, we over here trying to get out of New York City to go to Los Angeles for the LA Fit Expo. But we're having some issue, man. It's goddamn nature. Nature ain't fucking with my plans, man. But uh, we're gonna see if we can get out of here. Uh, it's intense. Did you vlog the way over here? A little bit, yeah. Yeah, it's like, the snow is it's in a blizzard. I, I gotta get the, even without the LA Fit Expo, I just gotta get the fuck out of New York right now. This shit is intense, man. I, I, I ain't trying to, you know, like, my heritage, you know, like, my, 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 my skin, man, my DNA was made to be in the, in the, in the, in the tropical climate, you know what I'm saying? Like, this is this, that, this, that European shit, man. Like, I'm tropical people, man. I don't deal as well with it. I saw a white guy running this morning, shorts on, man. Oh, this dude got a <laughs> this dude got a big baller brand shirt on. I don't know if that's dope or not. Anyway, let's see what happens. Brian, what's happening? So check it out. The reason you can't see outside is not because it's so right it's actual snow and uh we're getting hit with a storm they're calling it hold on they are calling it a bomb cyclone hey you can't say bomb in the airport they're calling it a cyclone that's bad enough as it is man like when you call a storm a cyclone it's serious so it's supposed to last probably till 7. They keep delaying the flight. We're supposed to be out of here at 10.30. It's like uh, it's 12 now. And they said the latest update was 2. But I don't see that happening. So uh, hopefully not too much later than that we'll get out of here. But if not, it looks like we'll be coming back tomorrow after the storm is over. So uh, yeah, we wait. Scale is in my bag, so I can't measure it. So I'm, I'm eyeballing this, I'm guessing. But half and half is good macros, man. Good keto macros, one card, good set. You know what I'm saying? I'm guessing, bro. I'm guessing. I don't like that. I'm expecting you to the airport for six fucking hours. How long we been here? Like days? We just live here now, man. We air, we were airport folk now. We're just airport. This is our new home. What are we gonna eat first? I don't know, man. I'm not the only one thinking that, Johnny. <laughs> It's like a ton of half and half double espresso in that butter. We've been in Queens all day. They get the snow off. <laughs> they should be out with cleaning these. <laughs> they be out with cleaning them and then let the plane take off. <laughs> That's all right, done. Boy, I remember one time <laughs> I was out in San Antonio and we had a fish market. We had the trout, tuna <laughs> fish, gumbo. <laughs> Oh boy, me and me and Clance. <laughs> Clance made the best goddamn gumbo the side of the Mississippi. People came from all around yonder. Get a get a get a mouthful of that gumbo. Clance old salty gumbo. And uh it was uh, you had it. Boy, I tell you what, I tell you, boy, you had that once. And yeah, that gumbo once, you'll never be the same. The life, yeah. The whole life change, boy. I, I, I remember one. 
One time. One time is a long time ago. This is a my old lady. At the time, you know, yeah, young boy, y'all know. He's that man that's back in the area, good boy, yeah. I got in the goddamn Model T. Model T. <laughs> Ford. Ford truck. Boy, I pulled up, I saw the young lady. Yeah, she was thick as a loaf of spring. <laughs> I was like, I can't keep going. I was going to take it somewhere. Man. We were here for eight hours, and then we just found out that the, the flight was canceled. They, um, they, 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 they kept streaming us along all day. Then they canceled it. Um, you know, a lot of people are flipping out. A lot of people are mad. You know, and I understand people have shit to do. Um, but uh, you know, I'm not really. It's life, man. Shit happens. You know, like like. Shit happens. The world, like the world, is not going to conform to your preferences. Every, you know, shit is not going to go your way most of the time, man. Honestly, if you just keep that in mind, like you don't get, I, get upset. I don't get that upset, like shit like this, out of my control. Like when I fuck up, or like, I mean, I still get mad sometimes. I'm tripping, but like, shit like this doesn't bother me. Like, like life. I think so great, man. Like it sucks anyway, right? And I think I don't think it's that great. But you know, it's it's like a game since we're here. We're gonna try to win. But at the same time, it's like there's a lot of worse shit to happen than this. You know, you know, there's a lot worse things that can happen than this. We were in warm weather. I mean, I mean, warm climate, climate controlled area. We had food. It's great music. We were able to, you know, we were able, to, like, you know, we we able, we, we live in America, you know, which is. I think dope, you know, like we live in New York City. I think the best city where, like, you know, all in all, life is good. If you focus on the bad, like, you, you can find it and it, you can get emotional about that, but whatever, man. I mean, just shit happens. Shit happens. Don't get emotional. Try not to get emotional about it. Roll with the punches, and especially in business, right? Cause this vlog, this channel is about business. Shit is almost never going to go your way. Almost, I mean, every time. Like, there's always going to be fuck ups. Just nothing ever is perfect. And you got to be able to, like, navigate through that without getting all emotional right because the more emotional you get it you know i can i can spaz out you know but we all do i'm human right but you want to try to be more even you know even like buddha said man suffering comes from desire right and i think what that old motherfucking meant was uh you get upset you know like you know like when your preferences when your circumstances don't align with your preferences, right? But you gotta understand that the world is not gonna conform to, to your preferences. The world is not gonna bend to the things you prefer, right? And you just accept that and be like, yeah, I would have preferred to got to LA today. That didn't happen. You know, just keep trying, just keep going. You gotta like take the hits and like, keep taking hits and keep going. That's kind of what it is, man. Especially in business. Especially in business, man. There's always ups and downs, ebbs and flows, highs and lows, and you just gotta, if you can navigate it, the more you can stay emotion, unemotional almost, right? Just, you're just going, no matter what. If it's good, you're going. If it's bad, you're going, you know? You'll be better. And this is no exception, you know? Like, so I didn't flip out, then it's fast, just I'm gonna go work out. And then I'm gonna come back here tomorrow, maybe, right? <laughs> you know, we'll see. Anyway, the three vlog squad, man. Keep your emotions in check. Keep going after you go. Just see a ghost, sleigh bell jingling, ring, jingle, jingle, jingle. Take time on, it's a lovely weather for a sleigh ride together with